Hey guys, Fast from X Force again with Scott from X Force Tactical. And today we're doing something a little bit smaller, so we're doing a little bit different. Um, obviously, not a gel blaster, but we're doing the new Ace Tech Bifrost. Uh, well, they're gonna correct this probably. They're calling it B Frost, but we're gonna go with Bifrost because we'll recorrect their correction. That's right. Uh, sorry guys, uh, but we kind of like the Bifrost. It sounds better. B Frost just doesn't well, sound right. You look at the, the Thor movies and stuff, the Bifrost bridge is all rainbow colors. Mm. This is a rainbow. It's Bifrost. 11 color. So for those that, yeah, don't know, I mean, it, it, it kind of goes with the Thor. They've got the Thor uh, suppressor for the Vector and Bifrost uh, Tracer. Um, yeah, it's kind of Marvel related. Somebody in there really likes their Marvel. No? That's a way to get around the copywriting, I guess. That's right. Um, so anyway, uh, let's get back to this. So the Bifrost is literally, you could say the next evolution evolution of the blaster tracer yeah um, so the difference is the blaster tracer had the flash and you had a tracer this thing's got flash tracer and form care bear stair bonus. 11 multicolor flame modes yep. now that is pretty cool and uh, the one thing that I do like is for those that want to be cool but fabulous you've got rainbow in there yep. Um, so it's even a, they've even got a sniper mode. Yeah. Uh, the thing to remember with this is, even though it flashes different colors, your gels will only if you have it on um, as a tracer mode, the gels will only gl glow the the green color of the gels. It won't make them a rainbow color. Mm. Unfortunately, we're still waiting on someone to make some really cool red. Yep. Um, Our gels yeah. only come in green. Yeah. All right. So only green. Tracer gels. We get a full um, stripe effect of the rainbow color. Mm. So in there you do get your adapters to go from 14 to 11 mil. Um, you do get USB-C. USB-C. So we're moving into the nails. In the now, in the nails of the future, um, you get your Bifrost tracer and you get a quite a comprehensive. Uh, instruction manual in English in English and Chinese of course. it's amazing how they actually fit all that into that little box yeah it, it really is because it was kind of hard putting it back in <laughs> um, all right so just gonna show you guys on here if you can see you got your red orange yellow green blue pink and purple so that's all the colors and you can get them to shoot I think per or yep whatever then you got your red green and, and blue so that's one mode your RGB your rainbow and then you got a dynamic rainbow um, and then you got demo which is a white light all right so <clears throat> let's have a look at this um, new Bifrost look at that that is cool so that basically is a Flash hider, yeah. baby suppressor. Yeah. Um, Look, but the, the little cutouts just here mm. will actually, uh, for look, it'll make it look like there is more of a flame in mm. whichever color you so choose. Yep. So there it is. There you can see the 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 unit in there. So to get to it, you've got your also your 14 mil thread. So that'll go straight onto most blasters. Uh, that have that sort of your V, yeah, mostly your V2s, your M4s. Uh, so unscrew that. That's got a nice little tight O-ring, so it's uh, well, I guess weatherproof, yeah. um, weather resistant, weather resistant, and your charging port there, and mode and flame. flame. All right, so mode, you change your modes. So on here, so like I said, you've got red. When you're ready. <laughs> there you go. X-Force colors. Yep. Orange. Uh, so I don't know if you can really, how well you see it. 
yellow, green, blue, pink, ooh, bright. purple, oh yeah. And the next one's red, green, and blue, RGB. And next one's rainbow. Right, so that'll, that'll flash twice. And then dynamic rainbow will flash three times. Three. And then your demo will flash four times white. Right. We do apologize if you are photochromatic epileptic. Yep. Because... I should, should, have, should have been a warning at the start. <laughs> don't say that now. <laughs> uh, other, we have watched other clips of people doing it in the dark. And yeah, it's pretty by cool crikey, one. these are bright. They're, they're bright in the dark. So we're doing it with quite a lot of light on here. Yep. But we will go down and, and put it on a blast and shoot it for you. But, you know... There it is. There's not much to it, but it's it is a beautiful thing. Mm. It's very solid. It's very metal, clean. Very clean. Design. Very nice. I really like that front bit there. Mm. It really is a really is a nice looking uh, unit. Cookie cutter. Yep. So um, does turn off after five minutes. Uh, it goes into sleep mode, and it will be awakened by shaking. Um, shake and bake function. Shake and so. bake function. Sure. Whatever. There you go. That is the Bifrost. 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 <laughs> All right. <laughs> let's go and test it out. You will trigger the snot out of me if you call it Bifrost. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys. So back at our range with our Bifrost tracer from Ace Tech. And we're running it on a JGM4 carbine. Okay, so firstly, I'm just going to put it on semi and I'm going to run it with some X Force uh, whites. So, just the milkies. So, just to show you guys uh, the color, I'll pop it up a bit in there. Uh, and without going into the tracer mode, uh, this is going to be a good indicator as to the flame. Okay, so get our glasses, our protection on, and I'll put it on. No. So I'll come around, come around to see the flash. Right. And I'll chuck it on full auto. Oh yeah, that is cool. Oh yeah, uh, fabulous and all. Um, all right, so I'll run it quickly a bit on. Bring it around again. So I'm going to put some traces in this time. If you remember how to put a mag in. And uh, this one's a... Um, how about we turn the light off and show them how it works. We turn the light off. And pretty glad we're swiping the light off. Oh. oh. All right, remember guys, if you have photochromatic epilepsy, please look away, it's even though it doesn't look cool. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. So, that was with... Uh, the milky whites. Now let's go to the tracer gels. I think my battery is going. Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, that 
my friends, is the Bifrost Tracer. I'll chuck some lights back on. Right, so, as you guys could see, that is the Bifrost Tracer. Uh, by Ace Tech. Very nice. And as you can see, it does not look out of place on an M4. Um, if you wanted to add, you know, onto anything else, it still look pretty cool. It is not the biggest. There are some bigger ones out there. Now the thing with it is, you can get. Uh, so this is the Bifrost, and there's a Bifrost M. Now that's the just actual unit itself, which will slide into other suppressors or whatever. So you can put it, you don't necessarily need to run it as is, you'll be able to get others. But we've got these uh, puppies coming very soon, should have them in the next week or so. So there it is, it looks cool, you saw what it does, it is pretty awesome. Mm. So um, and they're going to retail around about the 130-140 mark, a little bit more than the Blast Tracer, obviously having all the colours and stuff. Um, it's entering into a rave, really. It's yeah, freaking awesome. As you saw, especially with the tracers, that looked very mm. cool. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully that uh, was entertaining, uh, as it was for us. And uh, we'll see you guys next time with some more cool gear.